you being one of four kickers to be in the debate like that. How do you feel about your performance? I feel good, but still not satisfied. Obviously, um, I got bigger goals than that, yeah. What are those? Uh, Lou Groza for sure, but um, just to be better. Can you just take us through like the last three weeks? Like, what it was like just kind of thinking maybe you feel the field, maybe you want it this year, and now all of a sudden this happens? Yeah, I mean, I just took it one week at a time, and that's all I was told, so just taking it one week at a time, and then it was, it was a fun ride for sure. Hopefully, I keep going, Lord willing, and just keep working. It's most, most of us thought that Brandon was going to be back this week. When did you find out before the game, how much before the game, that you were going to kick that day too? I mean, Brandon, uh, he didn't travel this week, so I mean, I, I knew all week, but yeah. So, Chris, and I, I know it's really easy to tell people, you know, be patient, be patient, you know, yeah. wait, wait for your turn, but as somebody has, has gone through it, is that easier said than done when you ask somebody to be patient? I mean, no, I just trusted the process the whole time, just what my dad's told me always, and put my head down and worked, and it's worked out. What are some of the challenges of not having a scholarship and trying to play college football? I mean, it's definitely a challenge, um, and just like the burden in general over your family, just trying to work and go to school every day, football too. But I'm thankful right now that everything happened the way it did. What are some of the jobs that you've had to kind of keep the dream alive here? Uh, I mean, I've had my own like little stuff myself, but just focus on football and school mostly. Have, have you had the chance to tell your family and what was their reaction? No, I haven't actually told anybody, but my dad already knows. <laughs> Coach, Coach told me, but uh, yeah, haven't called anybody yet. Wait until after school. What did your dad have to say? Uh, he's excited, it sounds like, but I don't know. <laughs> we'll see. Any of your teammates say anything to you after that? Yeah, definitely. Everybody everybody told me a little bit, a little bit of something, but yeah. Anything in particular that stood out to you? No, was, Coach Herm was... Um, I remember was excited for me, but yeah, that's it. Thankful.